breaking news welcome to today's headlines after payment of over 200 million naira to bandit angry residents besiege zamfara government house after payment of over 200 million naira to bandit angry resident besieged Zamfara government house. To my dear listeners, from wherever you are listening from, stay tuned as I read today's news. In Zamfara state, Northwest Nigeria resident of Nauche community besieged government house. Gusau demanding Governor Bellows Matawali's intervention in some of the people that have been held captive by bandits. The angry resident revealed that 13 members of their community are in captivity having been abducted by bandits. Musa Abdullahi, who led the protest to the government, to the government house, revealed that the community has suffered more than 13 attacks, paid over 215 million naira, yet they would not have rest from bandit attacks. Speaking on casualties, Mr. Abdullahi said the community has lost over 50 persons in the last two years as a result of attacks while he pleaded with the government to intervene for the release of those being held. The situation has remained the same despite spending over 200 million naira on ransoms and settling vigilantes, he said. Abdullahi, a former chairman of the Bungudu Local Council, said five of the abductees had been held by the bandit for the past 33 days. He noted that the sum of 5 million naira ransom was paid for the five abductees. Yet the bandits refused to release them, but demanded for two boxer motorcycles which were yet to be met. While working to meet the fresh demand of the motorcycles, the bandits again stomped the community and kidnapped another eight persons. They are yet to communicate or make another demand from the community we are waiting, he said. The former chairman said the community of over 300,000 people was about to be deserted as the gunmen attacked the village frequently, killing people at will. We have acknowledged the effort of both state and federal government in tackling the security challenges. However, Nauche community needs Urgent intervention to prevent the town from being deserted. In Zamfara State, Northwest Nigeria, resident of Nahuche community, besieged government house. Gusau demanding Governor Belo Matawale's intervention in some of the people that have been held captive by bandits. 
the angry resident, revealed that 13 members of their community are in captivity, having been abducted by bandits. Musa Abdullahi, who led the protest to the government house, revealed that the community has suffered more than 13 attacks, paid over 215 million naira, yet they would not have rest from bandit attacks. Speaking on casualties, Mr. Abdullahi said, the community has lost over 50 persons in the last two years as a result of the attacks, while he pleaded for the, for the governor to intervene for the release of those being held. The situation has remained the same despite spending over 200 million naira on ransoms and settling vigilantes, he said. Abdullahi, a former chairman of the Bungudu local council, said five of the abductees had been held by the bandit for the past 33 days. He noted that the sum of 5 million naira ransom was paid for the five abductees, yet the bandit refused to release them but demanded for two boxer motorcycles which were yet to be met. While working